a lot of people have asked over the years if, if we're ever going to do Marginal Arts Festival again. Uh, the parade is what they really missed. So um, yeah, it's, it's definitely what gave me the impetus to go and apply for the Yoda grant. Um, I don't think I would have done it unless I knew people wanted something like that. The parade welcomes everyone to dress up and have fun and just show up at the parade. Um, the bigger concept is community building and that's where I'm trying to get groups to work together. And the groups don't have to work together to make the art necessarily, which is a lot of fun and it's really great. What I'm hoping the groups would do is um, represent a, a larger neighborhood or a lot of groups of people that don't always get to meet each other. And then coming together with a sort of barn raising attitude, like we're all gonna do something and make, make a difference. Uh, the difference in this case can be we're going to make some sort of three-dimensional parade art. Um, and it, it can get trivialized by people who are just going to make some art and that's all you're doing. But uh, I think all the steps along from getting together to make that art to actually spending the time uh, doing the different layers, um, finding out how this gets done, meeting people while you're working together, side by side, shoulder by shoulder, and just kind of like realizing, oh, this is gonna take three hours. Well, where do you live? You know, what do you like to eat? And just kind of shoot the breeze that way. So you don't have your elevator pitch, it's the opposite of an elevator pitch. What do you say for three hours to someone you don't know? And, and I think during that three hours is when you start saying like, wow, you know, that person's really cool. I didn't, I didn't know they lived three blocks from me or whatever. Um, and I'm hoping that's what builds the community. It's we take more time to get to know one each other um, as authentic, interesting, different than us kind of people. And, um, and to value that to value the fact that someone's different than us and they bring different skills that we don't necessarily have. And, and then we can be vulnerable enough to say, I need your help. I need someone to be able to do this for me.